Ah, hockey guys, and welcome to today's video. I got 50 1.18.2 mods for you. I hope you enjoy. And sorry, I'm currently in my internship for my study, so that's why I wasn't uploading. But um, I will try <laughs> my best. Now, have fun with the video. Ores within the deep slate region will now drop twice of the normal amount. Mix that with fortune. Holy! Overhauls the desolate and biome a bit, including new entities such as the Ender Firefly, Enderling, or Ender Blob, but also utilities like the Void Totem or Bold Shulker Bullets. Want a full showcase? Let me know. You may not like this one. Instead of exploiting villagers for enchants like Mending Forest Walker, only wandering traders will now sell them. Just truly treasures. <laughs> the title gives it away. Throughout the whole world, you may find more music discs or if creepers are killed by skeletons. This is a perfect mod for mod pack developers. Summoning rituals adds a table that can be used for different rituals. Itself, it doesn't come with any recipes, however, it is very easy to add some yourself. Instead of random selection, Manning will repair the equipment piece that is damaged the most. Now, when you mine ancient debris, you will get raw debris instead. You know, to just keep some sort of order, because <laughs> the other ores drop raw stuff now. It removes the small delay when using shields, making combat way more effective. Forgery. This is a big mod, both for fabric and forge, adding a wide variety of additions, tweaks and completely game-changing behaviors. Everything can be toggled and, believe me, this is a really big mod. Alongside new redwood trees to the old growth forest, players will find a small arrangement of flowers, new decoration blocks and items to build with. Just a small, neat vanilla plus building mod. Another building the creation mod, however, this time Twix is quite a larger mod. This grappling hook will help you climb the highest mountains or the biggest caves, even able to upgrade it with various different abilities like rockets, motors, etc. This mod focuses on food items, not only adding more recipes for already in-game items, but also including more meat types. Are you prepared to be cursed? No cubes will completely change the look of Minecraft into this smooth shape. If you like it, go ahead. Caution, this is very performance heavy. Simple barbecue. Do you love barbecue? Then this mod is for you. Get your food ready with the skewer and start grilling it. If you want, you can acquire special seasoning from the barbecue chef to make your barbecue even more special. These blocks give instant structures. For them to activate, players need to use instant wands. The new birch forest was an idea that was scrapped in a Minecraft Live update. Now you can have it! This enhances the nether by adding ores, generating the nether and various new building blocks and decorative details within the biomes. Maybe you're familiar with the popular mod pack Stone Block. You start in a world filled only with stone. Now you can relive that world present in almost vanilla Minecraft. Add a mod like Custom Starter Mod and voila! You can try to su survive in here. This handy mod adds various different brick blocks into your world. They come in various colors and shape variations. This is a real challenge. Water being finished from now on, the solar apocalypse has started. The first few days won't have any noticeable changes. However, beginning with day 3, the ground will start to die. Organic material will be set on fire, water will evaporate until day 7, will kill everything that's alive and above the ground. 
When players now fall into the void, they won't face death, but a fate worse than a mercy end. The void is a frightening dimension filled with barriers, structures, paranoia and deadly mobs. This mod allows players to create custom NPCs for your server. This mod is not only available for both Fabric and Forge, but is very highly customizable and in-depth. Your NPC can interact, chat, walk around freely or on a path, have different behaviors, etc. This is an add-on for Terra Lith. The main mod adds over 100 new biomes, whereas <laughs> towns and taverns adds custom pillagers outposts and villages. Exclusively to Terra Lith. A very cute small mod adding two new plushies into your world. I know this is quite small, but still a fun addition. If you love building but hate the movement limitation, Potion of Flight grants you a survival friendly alternative by adding a potion. This needs a new ore found within the darkness of caves. This one adds a few new mushroom stews for your crimson and warped fungi in the nether. This is a collection of different tweaks surrounding the elytra. Fireworks won't work anymore, however campfire will boost the players upwards if crouch is held. This block can also be stacked, boosting flying players more when multiple campfires are adjacent to one. It also comes with two new enchants like the smoke stack that can store the smoke to boost the player while flying. Infernal Expansion is quite a well-known mod for enhancing the nether dimension by adding various different mobs, hostile and neutral, new details such as quartz growing or bones sticking out of the ground, and even a new biome, the Glowstone Canyon. I don't understand why this isn't in vanilla Minecraft. Upgrade your netherite equipment with gold to pacify piglins. It really sucks that you have to at least wear golden boots to do this. If your mod pack adds enderite, this mod adds support to upgrade that as well. Axes normally lose to durability when hitting things because they are considered a mining tool, not a weapon. But with this mod, this behavior changes. The title is quite self-explanatory. Now you are able to find very rarely ancient debris in the overworld. If you like this idea, go ahead. Are you prepared to face some nostalgia? Tropicraft allows you to venture to the tropical dimension, an idea that was around since a long time. Now you are able to relive those memories or create some for the first time in Tropicraft with its new challenges, world and citizens. Oh, finally the solution when you want to travel with your four-legged transportation pal and you encounter the uncrossable water. <laughs> This mod focuses on historic and mining related items and mobs. Examples are the snail in lush caves or the graver in stony biomes. It also adds various building blocks such as the stone tablets and statues. There are also handy tools like the battery, lighter, fang and pincher trap. Not only does this Kappa Focus mod add new building blocks such as chains, doors and buttons, but also very handy tools like the wrench. The best addition is the copper infused chestplate for all tiers that will use the power of lightning to use two new enchants, e.g. sparkling will electrocute targets. Easy to explain. Players can dye leather horse armor to give your horses a fresh new look or of course you can go in a partner look. Maybe you have played Satisfactory. If you didn't, doesn't matter. Now you have the power tool from this well-known game in Minecraft. It even comes with a few upgrades that make your tool even more powerful, unlocking the 5x5 mining selection. This small mod is wonderful for all kinds of servers. It will display your head next to your name within the chat. Now you can even imagine with who you are probably talking to. Not only does this add the choice of choosing your desired resolution, but even a solution to add very easily your own images. <laughs> I mean, this is, this is really awesome. If you are looking for a completely new dimension mod, Infinite Abyss should do the trick. It features over 5 new underground cave worlds with various bosses and a ton 
of new mobs. Are you tired of rain? Who isn't? Then try to place down this end rod looking blaze rod. <laughs> it will prevent the rain to fall in a specified radius. If you love penguins, you will adore this brand new mod. World of Penguin adds over 5 new penguin species into your world. Time to have some new pets! This is an easy one. Some food items, just like stews, honey or pufferfish, will apply different effects when consumed. Another nature enhancing mod. This here adds new flora, but also various new blocks to build with, like concrete stairs, pebbles or hollow logs. Do you love role-playing? Aura Alarms adds various alarm sounds for you to use in your role-playing world. Even Nuclear Fallout or SCP. This dimension mod caught my eye with its beautiful textures. This brand new mod adds a new dimension with various mobs, one boss and new structures to explore. Are you brave enough to face the far-lit temple filled with ghostly figures? Help out the creator today by trying out their mod. This mod enhances raids by adding various new pillagers into your world. These can be as easy as the igniter or as horrendous as the spirit caller. I personally call him the archangel. <laughs> <laughs> like, wow. If you are bored, you can play bingo with your friends or against a time limit. Bingo allows you to start a new game with an easy, medium or hard difficulty mode. After every player joined a specific team, you can start. Upon doing so, every player will be randomly teleported and their inventory will be cleared. Press Y to extend the card over the whole screen. Good luck! This enhances everything about potions. Stackable with cooldown, milk can be bottled, weapons can be coated, umbrellas to shield you from potions, but it comes with various other tweaks as well, like the compound brewing stand, a faster upgrade that can even brew two potions at once in one slot. That was today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please leave a like or maybe even subscribe and we'll see us in the next video. Stay safe in game. Ciao!